The Cap de Creus is to be found at the extreme eastern limit of the Iberian Peninsula, in the northwestern part of the Mediterranean Sea. The surrounding sea is one of the most productive areas of the Mediterranean, thanks to the coexistence of exceptional factors that fertilize these waters, the abundant rivers that feed this sea, and the mixing of water due to the strong winds called Tramontana and Mestral that frequently blow. At Cap de Creus, there is a great complexity of marine inhabitants and an exceptional diversity of communities and species, many of which have great ecological, economical and gastronomic value. Artisanal fishing is the only kind of professional fishing that is permitted at the Cap de Creus. It is environmentally friendly in that it does not harm the seabed. There is different underwater research being carried out on the population of vulnerable fish, such as the dusky grouper and the brown meagre. The increasing number of these species demonstrate the positive effects of creating the natural park. Different from artisanal fishing, recreational fishing is increasingly more important as regards the extraction of coastal marine resources. The investigations carried out on the submarine canyon of Cap de Creus over the last few years by means of underwater robots has discovered in these depths species which are ecologically vulnerable, such as white corals. At between 25 and 50 meters of depth, the community of coralliginous is found formed by red seaweeds and benthic organisms which are ecologically fragile and vulnerable. There is a great diversity of seaweeds. The Cistocera form underwater forests which are very important for marine biodiversity. Underwater studies carried out on the marine Phanerogam at Cap de Creus have demonstrated that they are in a good condition compared with other parts of the Catalan coast. Furthermore, at Cap de Creus, small meadows have been found of other Phanerogams which have been practically disappeared from the Catalan coast. Also, the studies carried out at Port Ligat are pioneers in demonstrating that the meadows of Posidonia accumulate great quantities of carbon as they absorb carbonic anhydrides from the atmosphere. One of the healthiest ways of visiting the coast of the Cap de Creus from the sea is by kayak. In this area, there are different clubs and companies with kayaks that offer guided visits along the coast of the Cap de Graves. And there are companies with boats that discover, in a respectful way, the marine mammals in this area. The principal reason for the natural park of Cap de Creus is to protect the terrestrial and marine environment of this unique area. The exceptional ecological value of the water of the Cap de Creus makes necessary continual investigation in order to discover what these waters hide and how to best preserve them. But the effort to investigate and manage this natural area would be in vain if you do not help to conserve the marine ecology of the Cap de Creus. Follow the rules and practice the activities which most respect the environment. Thanks to the many who collaborate, we can continue to enjoy this gift of the Mediterranean.